Yo, what's going on guys? It's Aesthetic here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the HyperX PBT Pudding Keycaps. I'm going to be applying them to my DK61 keyboard. So yeah, um, I'm just going to do like a quick review. This video is not going to be too long. Uh, if you want to see how to put on keycaps, like take them off and then like put, replace them, I'll leave a video down below. But all I'm going to do is speed up this video while I put them on. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy. So yeah, uh, I'm not going to speed it up yet until I put them on, but let's see this here. These are the keycaps. Uh, I didn't know they were going to come like this, but yeah, we just have to open this pack. I'm going to open all the packaging and then just like dump them out. And then we're going to speed up the video while I put them on. <gasps> That's not good. Alright, so I got all my uh, keycaps off. I uh, have to say, I'm kind of disappointed. I mean, I think there's like some hair in here that I think I'm just going to blow out. I don't even know how it got there. But I'm going to plug the keyboard in for you guys. So you guys can just see the RGB with the keycaps off. Okay, so the RGB looks pretty nice. I wish it was a little bit brighter, but other than that. And like I had better pattern. I don't even know why I unplugged. Maybe if I plug it in this way. I don't know why it's not working. Okay. There we go. Now, see the RGB. I'm sure the keyboard works. Everything. <laughs> I'm not going to test that. But yeah, I'm going to put the keycaps on while the video is sped up. And I'm going to leave the RGB on just so you guys can see how it looks while I'm putting them on. But I'm going to go clean the keyboard and then I'll be back. And here is the finish. Um, it looks really good. And, like, I, I'm looking at, like, it on OBS, and it actually, like, looks kind of bad. But, like, in real life, trust me, even though my keyboard's RGB is, like, pretty, like, a little bit low, and it's not really the best, it still looks amazing in real life. And I also want to explain I have my F keys here because it makes it easier to hit your thumb binds. That's why they're here. Uh, not... 
like I have this here. I did not do this on accident. This is intentional. If you can even see it on the camera, I'm not exactly sure if you can or not. But if you can, then that is why. Because the F keys have higher elevation than regular keys. So that's why I have it like that. Like I tried it out and I liked it, but when I switched over to this keyboard, I couldn't do it again. But I'm doing it with these keycaps. So, yeah, I mean, without further ado, I'm going to get into a game. Alright guys, I'm getting into a game right now. Um, this webcam angle is good, but I can't use it because I think my webcam will fall really easily. Like any movement on my desk, it will fall. But I'm just going to do some free building with it. Uh, I literally just got on. I haven't played it at all today, so I'm going to be bad. I just kind of, I mainly want to show off, just want to like show off the keyboard mainly. And also, if you could see before, my tab has a blue switch on it. Like right here, and then my escape has a brown switch on it. Just that's just because I was accidentally pressing them too much. And yeah, I mean, getting in, and I'm not sure if I like the F keys on my thumb binds right now. Uh, they feel really weird. They feel like they felt a lot better on my razor. That's for sure. I'm not sure if I'm gonna want to get used to these or if I'm just gonna go back to regular keys. But other than that, it's like it. It's not about like performance or anything, but it's like it just looks really nice. Like while I'm playing, it's you can see the RGB a lot better because of because they're putting keycaps and they're PBT, so they're like really strong too. So you're getting good RGB and you're not downgrading keycaps for it. Like these keycaps feel really nice. They use really good PBT material. And yeah, I would 100% recommend getting them. They feel really nice and the RGB is really good. It's outstanding. It looks a lot better than it does on camera. And I don't know why that's like that. Like, I saw that with other people, too, and it still even looks good on camera. But I'm telling you, it looks a lot better in real life than on camera. So, yeah. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Oh, sorry about that. Also, guys, before I roll the outro, I just wanted to do a typing test to see if these keycaps make my keyboard sound any different. So, yeah. Anyways, I just want to say, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry that I got a call from my home phone, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. And comment, like, subscribe. Everything in the dis everything will be linked down below. And I know I'm gonna have timestamps on this video too. So yeah, peace out, guys.